Uh, thank you for tuning in guys. Today we're going to be doing some video card comparisons because we have lots of users who really ask us what's the difference between the three graphic card options we have. Um, the 675, the 680 and the 7970. Uh, basically these are all mobile variants of the cards and uh, we're going to be just taking a look at the differences between the few so that you guys can roughly understand what kind of performance difference you're expecting based on which card you choose. So here we have um, an X17 equipped with a 680 running Battlefield 3. So this is running on all Ultra with an NTA lighting up and as you can see the performance is uh, pretty good. A 680 is generally able to handle Battlefield 3 easily at Ultra settings and you get FPS ranging from, depending on the location you're at, ranging from the mid 40s to 60 even just depending on where you're at. So for users that are looking to play Battlefield 3 on Ultra, you'd either be looking at a 680 or a 7970, which we'll come to shortly so you can see the performance. Alright, next for our comparison, we have the X15 with the 7970M. This is with the latest Catalyst 13.1 drivers and we have been testing these drivers a lot recently and they are amazing. I can say that for most games, the performance that we are seeing for the 7970 is almost similar or in some cases slightly better or slightly worse than the 680. So we have BF3 running here at Ultra, everything is maxed out and we are getting a consistent frame rate above 60. And this is on a single 7970M at ultra settings with NTA lighting up. So here we have an X15 and the X15 is running on a 675M. So this is based on the Fermi architecture. A 675M is actually a very different graphics card from the 680. And so we have this running on ultra as well at full HD. And as you can see, the FPS we're getting, it's still pretty decent for a notebook, but it's below 30. So we're getting uh, FPS in the range of 30 to 40 in less dense areas. So if you're looking to play games like Battlefield 3 and, you know, Crisis 2 and Ultra, a 675 can do it, but you probably would have to turn AA off, just turn off the anti aliasing while if you're looking to just max out everything and run an Ultra, you're going to be looking for at least a 7970M or a 680M.